One of the key things if you are into research is getting the research published. I have already made several videos on how to choose a research topic, write a research article, a review article, and how to check for plagiarism and others. You can check that out in my research and publishing playlist linked in the i button above and in the description below. Many of you might be emotionally attached to your research. You have seen so many failures in your experiments. You have spent days and nights for meeting the research objectives. You have invested so much of your attention and energy in writing, rewriting and correcting the manuscript that it becomes obvious when you upload your research article or review to a suitable journal, you have high expectation that it should be accepted. If not, you get hurt. And you are watching this video because either you yourself have faced rejection or know a close one who is struggling for his or her paper to get published. In today's video, you will learn how to deal with manuscript rejection without getting upset about it. So stay tuned till the end. The foremost thing is selecting a journal. Assess your work, its strength and based on this, choose a suitable journal. Go through the aims and scopes and upload to it only if your paper meets their requirement. You may also refer to their previously published papers. For more details, you must watch my video on how to choose right journal for publishing in the description below. If you receive reasonable and doable comments from editor or reviewers, you may see it as an opportunity to improve your paper and submit it back to the same journal or other journal. Some high impact and society journals are highly competitive and they consider only the exceptional work to be published. And the editor or the reviewer may not see your work that worthy. Also, editors and reviewers have their own viewpoint and perception. One may see your paper suitable and other may find it just the opposite. If you think their decision was not correct, you can make an appeal or ask more specifically about the shortcomings in your paper. So it is better to assess the worth of the manuscript, the method you followed, the outcomes by yourself. If you think the paper is worthy, you must not lose your heart. There are dozens of journals out there. At last, I want to tell you that rejection of paper is not the end of research. Research in publishing is a process and everyone, irrespective of how great professor or researcher they are, at some point have faced rejections. It's just we see and remember the successfully published papers of others, we think they are doing great but the truth is they too got rejected many a times. So rather than being upset about a rejection and become depressed, start working on the improvements if you think there are any and target another journal. If your work has worth, it will definitely get published. But do take care not to publish it to a predatory journals which are unreviewed and publish your paper in return for paying some handsome amount. Then there are journals too that charge money for publishing but are reviewed. If you do not want to pay money for publishing your article, you may choose subscription based journals in which readers have to pay but authors need not to pay any money. If you want me to make more videos on similar topics, do mention in the comment below. You were watching Explore Bio. If you want to learn more about research and publishing, I have made series of videos on it. Do check them out in the description. If you have any queries or suggestions, feel free to comment or email me at explorebio at yahoo.com. 